What's up guys, this is my brand new Mercedes Geely and I just picked this thing up at the dealership and it may not show on camera but right now this car is dirty and that's because I've asked the dealership to not touch the car. So these are made in the US, they get shipped to Germany, then they come over here in Belgium and they simply just get dirty on their way here. So this is how new cars are delivered to the dealership. It's also the reason why there still is a bunch of like plastic covering and cardboard inside the car. So yeah, this is a uh, true new car experience. And then one thing I would like to mention is I do have new wheels coming for this car. I don't really like these wheels, but these are the only option that I could get at the time. So in the next video, we will get them swapped out, which will look way better on, uh, on this car. Also, I'm thinking about changing, or maybe not changing, but at least changing out the uh, chrome trim pieces on this car even though this car has the night package it still has a couple of like you know chrome uh, pieces on here such as these door handles and this front grille and stuff if you guys have any suggestions of what i should do to this car or what i should change let me know leave a comment down below and uh, let's get this thing washed now
So now that the car is clean, I removed the badges on the back of the car to give it that cleaner look. Not only does it look cleaner, it also makes cleaning easier in my opinion because dirt will only get stuck in between these badges. So I prefer it without. So now that the emblems are removed, I went on to polishing some of the black gloss pieces on the car such as these pillars and mirrors and stuff like that. We then got them protected with PPF, so shout out to my friends over at BB Car Care for helping me out on that. We also did a PPF smoke on the headlights, which makes the car look a little bit more aggressive, I guess you could say. So after all that, I continued polishing the car. I just did a one-step polish with Coach Kemi Microcut. Also used a Coach Kemi Microcut pad. Paint was in overall good condition, so I didn't really have to do a heavy paint correction. Just a simple one-step with Coach Kemi Microcut was just enough to get this paint perfect. Once the car was all polished, I then applied my ceramic coating. I applied Secord's Finest Reserve, which is the professional grade ceramic coating by CarPro. I topped it off with Secord's SIC, and this combination is my favorite combo. It's just amazing. The slickness it provides is insane. Alright, so that's gonna be it for this video. We got the car cleaned up, we got it polished, we got it protected. In the next video, I'll show you guys how well this coating performs. So we'll, we'll, uh, we'll give it its first wash. And we'll also get the new wheels on, which are right there, and they are sick. So stay tuned for that. Once again, if you guys have any suggestions of what I should or could do to this car to make it look even better, please let me know in the comments. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate every single one of you, and I'll catch you guys next time.